What is going on my lovely ladies? My name is General Tony and I will be your host for this video. So guys, have you ever sat there and wondered to yourself at night time, what troop, what troop would be the best to go with healers? Have you wondered it? Because I bloody haven't. But one of you did and you asked me to do a golem, so I'm going to do a golem healer. Let's see if it works. Now we are going to do something slightly different in this video. Instead of doing raid, raid, live raid, we're going to do a raid, then we're going to do a live raid, and then we're going to do another raid. So we're going to keep it exciting! So if you did miss the first video, guys, I did start the shout out in there. So I want you to guess in the comment section down below how many days, how many hours are on these level 4 Pekka upgrades. Now don't forget to let me know any social media you want to shout out for. And because I haven't given away a gift card in quite a while, we are going to be giving away a $10 gift card to the winner. Let me know what gift card you want, iOS or Android. So we're about to get our sexy little butts into the first raid, guys. Now let me know what you expect in the comment section. Do you think, do you think that this big ass rock, this big ass golem, is going to be able to get the three star? Now there's no queen. The only thing coming is a king. We may have a clan castle. It just depends if we have one or not. Inside of the live raid, do we have one? Yes, we do. So we got six giants. They'll be coming along shortly. So we're going to get ourselves into a replay. Then we're going to do a live raid, and then we're going to do another replay. So shit's about to hit the fan, we come in, we've got a single golem, we have 15 healers, we've got a king, we've got a raid spell, a jump spell, a poison spell, and four bloody earthquakes! Can we get the three star though? That's what I'm talking about. So we've dropped the golem up the top left on the left hand side of the base, he's gone straight for the wall guys. That is what we expected, it's what we like to see, we like to see the golem go straight for the purple wall. He's taking on that wall, he's doing some damage, pow! Pow! Yeah, pow, pow, pow. We dropped about five healers behind. Well, four healers to be exact. Where is the king? King? Where are you? We're going to speed this up because this bugger is slow as hell. He's so fat, guys. This is why you shouldn't be obese. As a child, you should not be obese because this bloody happens. If you're a ninja, if you're a goblin, not a goblin, a ninja. If you're a ninja bloody goblin, you'd be able to jump over the walls. But no. Oh, no. The bloody golem is fat little shit and doesn't. he's not able to do shit. So we went four times speed, but now we've gone back to one time speed. We've dropped in nine healers so far. Here come a couple more. Trying to keep the king alive, trying to keep the golem alive. Now we don't have any other troops. It's just 15 healers, one golem. But we do have some troops inside of our CC. Oh, oh my bloody god. Why balloons? Out of every troop we could have had, both of them are air troops. Whoever gave me them. I have a feeling who gave me those troops. You suck. So we got some balloons. We got some minions, guys. Not really doing much, though, are they? Look at all the air bombs, air mines coming up. Doing some real damage to my loons. See you later, darlings. You have been absolutely shit. You haven't done anything for me. The final minion's about to go. Oh, my God. A single barbarian. This guy's got balls. I'll give him that. He's got, he's got nuggets on him, guys. He's able to take on that wall all by himself. He has 59 seconds. Can he take down the wall? Four times speed. Chung, chung, cha, ching, cha, chung, cha, ji, cha, chung, cha. And we look back in the center. Back to the barbarian. Chung, cha, ching, cha, 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 cha. He moved walls. Are you serious? He actually moved walls, guys. This raid has just gone to shit. Didn't really manage to do anything. And that little cunt decided to move walls. Only 34%. We got the one star, which is pretty much just luck. So as promised, as promised, we're about to go in for a live raid as a second raid. So I decided to change these up. Now obviously I'm not going to be doing the exact same attack strategy as the first because that sucked. That sucked ass. So inside of our camps we have six giants inside of the clan castle as you know. Now we do have the king. We've got four earthquake spells, one poison, one jump and two rage spell this time. Go for a little bit of a rage. Now we've got 12 healers, one golem. And I've decided to, you know, just change it up a little bit. A little bit of pick and mix. So what we're going to do is, we've got five barbarians, five archers. We're going to try and clear as many buildings before sending them in. Then we're going to send them in. Hopefully they can clean up some free loot. So we're going to go into an attack. We'll be back when we're inside of a decent raid. Alright guys, alright, I can do this. I know I've got this. I've got this in the bag. My plan is to get in there and take that Dark Elixir. Because there is quite a lot of Dark Elixir inside of the core there. So what we are going to do... Now, we do have some wall breakers, so it's good, it's good. we got some wall breakers. I would like to kill the queen. I would like to forget about the king. Don't even have to go near him. So, we're going to attack from here. So, we're going to drop in the wall breakers. Not the wall breakers, the earthquake spells. Going to drop in the earthquake spells. There we go. And we're going to send all of the eight wall breakers, all 16 wall breakers in straight away, just to make a few more openings, guys. We want to get inside of this base. We're going to drop in the, uh... oh, damn, this is going to be a little bit hard, actually. We're going to drop in the golem. And we're going to chuck in the king. Now, we're going to send in some of those. No, no, go to the golem, please. There we go. Oh, damn, they've got two air defenses. We're surrounded, guys. We're surrounded. Going to have to send in the giants. And then we're going to hold back with the actual barbs and the archers. So, we're going to drop a raid spell. Hopefully, get those giants. Oh, my God, I missed them. Guys, this raid is going bad already. You already missed the giants. There we go. All right. 
So the, uh, the healers are being targeted, but they are managing to keep the golem alive. They've targeted the giants now as well. There's nothing inside of their CC. It would appear, why did you have to do that for? Why? Why, oh, why, oh, why, oh, why would you ever do anything else? Yeah, guys, not really going too well. Why, why would you do that? There's an opening right there, and there's a blow. Oh, my God, guys. Oh, my God. All right, here we go. Jeffrey, you ready? Jeffrey's ready. Go on, Jeffrey, my son. That's it, my son, Allison. Actually, Alice. You sexy little chica. All right, Alice is going to work. Jeffrey's gone inside. We've got to keep an eye on Jeffrey. Now, we're going to try and keep these little barbs and archers alive. We still have quite a few healers up. I'm not sure where they are. Where's the king? King? Oh, there we go. King's finally going to take on the queen. Go on, slap that bitch. That is my son. That is what I'm talking about. We're actually quite close. Oh, there we, we got a jump spell, guys. I forgot we had a jump spell. We're actually quite close to the Dark Elixir. Oh, my God, we're going to get it. Go on, king. Rage up the king. No, no, no. Go for the Dark Elixir, please. There we go. That is it, my son. Get that Dark Elixir for Tony. That's it. Clean all of that up for Uncle Tony. Uncle Tony is proud of you, my son. There we go, guys. We managed to get all of that. Still got three healers left, so we're going we're gonna to try something here. We got, we got, we got to send in the pack. All right. Michael Jackson, Julian and Jeffrey. Go, go, go. Go, team, go. Gonna send in the two bitches. Where are you going? Sending them just behind, and they decided to fade off towards the right-hand side. Going towards the golem. All right, all right. This could be good. All right. Allison, Jackie, Maisie, and Dooley. I don't bloody know what to call them, but they're all little sluts, guys. They're gonna start shooting the shit for Rathke. No, I'm only joking. They're not little sluts. Beautiful little chickens. Beautiful. All right, go on, then. We're gonna send in. Who are we gonna send? We're gonna send in the queen. Go on, darling. Yeah, yeah. Oh, are you staying with the Chicas? Yes, you are. We have got invincible archers on the right-hand side. This is going good. This is going good. Looks like we're going to be able to do something decent here. We got a poison spell as well. Now, let's see. Where can we drop this? All right, we got the king now. We're not going to waste it. Not going to waste it. So, we've still got a couple of Chicas. Are they going to reach? Whoa, we've actually managed to get a decent amount of Dark Elixir here, guys. Come on. If the archers reach that Dark Elixir drill there, this could be a very decent raid. Now, we haven't got the 50%. We have got 40, which is obviously bollocks because we don't want 40. One in 50. But it's all right. We're getting some of that Dark Elixir. That is it, my chicas. Go on. Clean it up. Clean it up. They're going good. It's honestly going good. The Golem and the Giant are both still alive. This raid has been mind-blowing. So we're about to come to an end. See you later, guys. You have been an absolute... Well, you've been all right this raid, I suppose. Not too bad, but two and a half thousand Dark Elixir. I will happily take that. All right, so there it was. There was the live raid. Now we are going to get our little butts into another replay, guys. So we're going to change it up once again. Obviously, the Queen is... Uh, she's sleeping. Who likes to do things to the queen when she sleeps? Not me. Okay. Yes, this is the uh, the second replay. Now, if we just take a look at the army, just paused it for a second. Take a look at the army. You can see we have decided to drop three healers and bring six additional wizards. Got some wizards inside of there. Only got a rage spell. Now, I think this attack was actually rushed. Now, we're going to see. I can't remember doing it, to be honest. It was done about four hours ago. So, we'll see where we did attack from. So, we dropped the golem in. Gone in with some of the porters. And here comes the wall breakers. Now, they did have a CC. Wall breakers actually managed to get through. Dropped the poison spell. A little bit too much on my side. Needed it a bit more towards them, guys, so I could have killed their Harrys. Didn't manage to kill them, so we did have to drop in our Rage spell. Now, it's Harry very Harry. My Harry wiped out their Harry. We were also under heal as well at this point, so we're doing good. We're, good. we're doing decent, not good. It's okay. We've dropped in the last Mr. Potter as well, and I'm afraid all of my little Harrys, none of them were getting healed at this point. I don't know why, but for some reason, healers love to heal targets. We love to heal troops, which go for defenses. Like, they love to heal hog riders, love to heal golems, love to heal giants. They don't like to heal anything else, and for some strange reason, they also love to heal heroes. I don't know why. Don't ask me why, guys. It's just something they like to do, or maybe they just like to piss us off. So at this point, I'm pretty sure you can all see and understand that we have lost every single one of our little potters. We've even lost the king. Some little larrys. Oh, these larrys. They're such little buggers, these guys. So cute, though. They're so cute. Wouldn't you just love to grab their cheeks and then smash their face in, guys? Just smash their face in. No, I'm only joking. I'm only joking, kids. So the golem is still alive. We're going to have to do this four times speed, guys. we got nothing else on the entire map. Golem's still alive. Let's see how many defenses he can take down. So it's Golem 1 taking down the cannon. He's now connected onto the mortar. The Golem is taking down the mortar. Taking down the mortar. He's now gone for the Tesla. That's three defenses he's taken down. The Queen is already down. Going for the Expo. There is only 20 seconds left. Can we take down the Expo? Are we going to do it? It looks like we're going to do it. And we end the raid. Yes, we've done it. Can we get the Dark Elixir? No, because the Golem sucks ass. So the raid ends there. Unfortunately, only 31%.
So there we have it guys, we have answered your question, well I have answered your question. The long asked question, one of the biggest myths inside of COC, can a golem with healers 3 star a base? No it bloody can't, it doesn't even come close, even if you chuck Harry Potter's balloons giants inside of there as well, still doesn't come even close. Definitely, uh, well it might have been a little bit closer if we had the Archer Queen, but you know we didn't have her. So that answers the question guys, I would not try this at home kids, definitely not worth it. Don't forget to let me know in the comment section down below how long is left on the P.E.K.K.A. upgrade. Also let me know what other trip would you like me to try with healers guys. Comment down below, give me your ideas. I will see you tomorrow for the first video of the day. If you didn't check out today's first video, please go and watch it. Feel free if you want. Tell your friends to sub to the channel guys. I will see you shortly. Have a great evening. Peace out.